Yes, fellow Ghanaians. This is your property. This is your wealth. This is your resources. Abandoned. And no one to live in. And people are looking for homes. People are looking for homes. Can we do something about this? Can we? Can we do something about this? It's very important that we don't abandon this. All right? It's our home, it's our property. And if government cannot manage, I'm asking government to put it in my hands to manage it. I will take it and manage it for government and pay money to government. This is our wealth. This is our property. This belongs to Ghanaian people. And we have abandoned it to rot. Look at this. This is not John Mama's property. This is not Bernard Kubas's property. This is not Hassan Ayaga's property. This is the property of the Republic of Ghana. As you can hear, windows hitting each other every minute. Okay. Glasses breaking. Look at this. I'm just walking around the property. This is not fair. And there are millions of Ghanaian people who are looking for homes. Who are looking for homes. I am not against any political party, none against any president, but I'm against bad leadership. And this cannot be right. This cannot be right. This cannot be right. This cannot be right. Never. This cannot be right. Look at this. And millions are sleeping in the bush. Some, uh, it's, this cannot be right. Look. Are we serious as a nation? Are we serious as a nation? Are we serious as a nation? Why? Are we serious? Huh? A whole town, a whole town. Look, a whole town. Who will waste his own money to do this? Will former President Mama waste his money to do this? Will President Nana Kufadu waste his money to do this? Look, look, just look. Just look, thousands of home rooms. Thousands of homes. <sighs> this is serious, this is sad. Government should wake up. This is sad. Very, 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 very. I just came and bought 50 acres of land just close to this place to put up my own housing project. But if I look at this, I get sad. I have just acquired 50 acres close to this place sure that we're doing the right thing as government can we be sure are we serious anyway uh, I am calling the president to make good use of this place for the people of Ghana or else very soon I will invite Ghanaians to come and start living here for free I think it will be better if they start living here for free okay just listen to the noise the windows are hitting each other boom look at it Open the gate. Yeah. Yeah, look at how it's, all the glasses will break. All the glasses will break. All the windows will break. Can you imagine? Look, look at the noise. Hmm? Yeah, but is it not better than wasting it? Yes. Look at the inside. Huh? The workers, those I'm sure those who are working here, yeah. uh, those who are working initial workers. Uh, uh, what is there? The entrance. This is so sad. Very, very, very bad. Very, very bad. And we are complaining no, accommodation, accommodation. And people are crying, looking for places to sleep. And we have wasted this property. This is our taxpayers' money. It doesn't belong to any party. 
It's not for NDC, it's not for MPP, it's not for APC. It's for the taxpayers. We pay taxes to build this. And we are wasting it. And we, 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 we sit down and go and borrow money and borrow money. And this is what we do with the money borrowed. Just for some people to make money and then we waste it here. This is it. There's no ent we can't even we can't even access the entrance. We can't even access the entrance. Huh? We can't even access the entrance. Look, we can't even find an entrance to the properties. Everywhere is trees grown, grass, every part of it. Can you imagine? Your money, our money, government money. You see? You see? What are we going to do with this? Ghanaians who are ready, I am giving government one month to look work on this. If not, Ghanaians should move and come and start living in these homes. Just move and start come and occupy. Just come and occupy. Just move and come and occupy. This is sad. This cannot be acceptable. You see? You hear the noise? Windows heating and breaking. Just here. You see? Breaking. Boom. Boom. Every second. Look at the roads. In the community. If not Africa, will a sensible human being build this and throw it away? If it's your own resources. When we talk, it says we're against government. I'm not against any government. I'm not against, I'm against bad leadership of our leaders. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? This bullshit. What is this? Look. Huh? Oh my God. Oh, in Africa. Ghana, our motherland. Let's wake up. Let's wake up. Let's take responsibilities. Let's do what is right against what is wrong. It's our duty. It's our duty to do what is right against what is wrong. We cannot allow this to continue. And we call it leadership. We call it partisan politics. This is not politics. This is wickedness. This I call it wickedness, not politics. So leaders should wake up. It's not right. It's just not right. I am not happy. So for me, ah, let's make a difference. 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 Citizens, let's make a difference. This is sad. This is sad. Let's make a difference. Let's make a difference. It's, 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 I mean, it's, this is not politics. You can call this politics. This is not politics. Look, look, look over there. This is not politics. Just go in. This can be politics. This bad leadership. Bad leadership. It's not politics. You hear the noise? Why? Military don't have homes. Police don't have homes. Fire service don't have homes. Ghanaians don't have homes. Beggars don't have homes. Yet you have abundance of thousands of homes here. Who wastes his money for this? Nobody. I am giving them enough time. If not, I will take control of this. Clean the whole place and rent the whole place out. Rent it out. I'll just rent it out. I don't care. I just went out. I mean, it's... no, 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 no. Let's do something, guys. Ghanaians, let's do something. Let's do something. I mean, enough is enough. Let's do something. Let's do something. Thank you. I'm Hassan Ayerga, founder and leader of the EPC. But this is not about political leadership. This is about mental disorder of our leaders.